This is Cheyenne. Cheyenne's here at the Wild West Mustang Ranch in super horse training. Cheyenne's not a Mustang, but we don't hold that against her. It's all good. We love all horses. So she's here for super horse training. This is her first 30 days of training. She hasn't been to another trainer and been saddle started or been out riding and had problems. She just come just kind of raw right from right from the pasture to us. So. She's just at her graduation point. A few last little things to do. One, when I go on a packing trip, I'm a pretty essentials guy. Like, I take like next to nothing. It's simple. A can of beans and a can opener and a sleeping bag. So that's what I've got here. I've got a sleeping bag here. i got an extra sleeping bag on the other side in case I run into somebody out in the woods and they need a sleeping bag. So that's me being prepared. So, apologies first. Maybe you are in order all of my packing friends. What you're about to see, just, that's all, I'm just gonna say that. So I apologize. So Ben Masters, I'm branded. Yeah, I rode with you guys. You guys know how to pack. You guys did that, right? Micah and Mike up at Heroes and Horses in Montana. My apologies, because what you're about to see is not packing. Right? So anyway, let's just, let's just get to it. Yeah, it's about having fun with your horses. That's first rule in horsemanship is there are no rules, and the second rule is have fun. It's supposed to be fun with your horses. So Cheyenne's locked, ready to roll, ready for anything. So let's do this. So we got her all rigged up. To go packing but then you know I might I might run into somebody out there like I said maybe a maybe a backpacker maybe a hikers out there and maybe they're too tired to make it back to camp I want to be prepared so I'm gonna bring a bike so if this hiker is a little too tired he can ride a bike and ride the bike back home so All of this has got to be uh, OSHA approved and safety, so I'm just doing a safety check. Alright. So I got that in case I went into a backpacker that's tired. It might rain. So, you know, everybody's got to have a rain slicker. Alright. And I want to build a fire. So I probably ought to take a chainsaw. But you know how it is when you take your chainsaw and you go up to cut wood, the damn thing won't start. So let's just make sure it'll start before we get there. I might not want to get wet while I'm sleeping, so I'm going to bring a tarp so I can tarp my sleeping bag. <laughs> Done. See how easy packing is? I don't know what the good freaking mill is. You just throw stuff on and go. It's so easy. I might want a chair. Because you know, when I'm sitting there talking to the backpacker that's tired and sore and needs to borrow my bike to get off the mountain, I want to be comfortable. So. I want to make sure I got me a chair. And then I want to be a clean, responsible equine backcountry horseman. I'll bring my own poop rake. Right? In case I gotta, you know, clean up and leave no trace. I want to, you know, make sure it's all nice and clean. I don't know what we'll 
little bit of this. But you know, if you want to taste, it's kind of like taking your wife on a trip. You gotta find space for everything. So, oh, here we go. There we go. Okay. I'm gonna go, I'm ready to go on a pack trip. I'm just gonna leave right now. I don't even need a saddle horse. I'm just gonna go. So, <laughs> if you'd like your horse started at the Wild West Mustang Ranch's Super Horse Training, and this is the kind of packing trip you want to go on, I can get it started for you. You can be packing in 30 days, ready to go. So, yeah, call me. We'll work something out. Let's go, Shane. There is nothing but Faith holding that chair up there. <laughs> no, I don't.